just moments ago in the House Rules Committee, the Rules Committee that is dominated by the Democrats, in a procedural move, took SB 9, the Senate bill that I was in control of in the House, away from me. They used a procedural move to take this bill from me, which must mean their only intent is a massive tax hike of over $5.4 billion on the hardworking folks in Illinois. If this is your intent, perhaps you guys should know that Illinoisans largely do not want this tax hike. In fact, in a recent poll, around half of likely voters said spending cuts should be the only tool used to close the budget gap. 64% oppose a state budget that includes raising the state income tax. 51% are opposed to raising the state income tax, even if it comes with a property tax freeze. Raising taxes in the absence of spending cuts was notably unpopular. That support never registered above single digits. The Illinois Policy Institute did this poll, and I think you should take note. Illinoisans do not want a massive tax increase. This is the last thing we should be doing, and for you to pull this bill from me simply shows that the Democrats are not interested in bipartisan support on what we should be doing with taxes. I pre-filed the bill for the bill back on January 23rd, which is something that anybody could do so that I could help control the conversation on taxes when that bill, if that bill, came to the House. So, Democrats, by taking back control of this bill, it must mean you only want a massive tax increase. The people should be aware they can expect, once again, the House will most likely pass a bill without the revenue to support it, leaving us worse off in the end. So it, it, it's in, incredible that you guys ignore the facts on the ground. You ignore that business is leaving. You ignore that residents are leaving. You ignore the fact that we have the highest property taxes. That every bill that we see, and again, a bill in labor and commerce that we will see again today, is actually hostile to business. No business, no jobs, no jobs, no people here, no people here, no taxes. So uh, that is the problem with Illinois. I think we should work bipartisanly on a solution, and taking this bill from me was the wrong approach.